In this digital era we're in at the moment, we rely heavily on storage devices for our personal computers, laptops, consoles, mobile phones, cameras. We've had the old 3.5 hard drive, the laptop 2.5 inch, the SSD, the USB stick, the SD card and the micro SD card, just as important as each other. Now there are times when these micro SD cards can become corrupt and that's happened to me a few times. I've lost precious, precious files. And have you ever actually accidentally formatted your SD card? I have. Now there's an application that I have used. It's called Wondershare Recover It. So this is the Wondershare Recover It interface. We have the hard disks, the external devices as well. You can select locations, recycle bin, desktop, folder, or recover from crash computer. Now these can recover any types of files from videos, pictures to documents, from defective drives, formatted drives, or just plain lost data, accidentally deleted data. What you need to do is check your device. So I'm gonna choose my external SD card, my micro SD card. Select that and click start. This will now start scanning your device for any files. Now, depending on the size of the device, scanning times will vary. Obviously, the larger the device, the longer the scan will take. Okay, so that scan completed and found 2,727 files. Click OK and we have the file paths here. You can click file type as well and just show you the photos, videos of what you've recovered. You can drill down into those as well. Drill down into there. You have JPEGs. Now, depending on how old some of the data is, you can see a preview there that's worked. There might be some really, really old data that's been overwritten too many times or formatted and probably impossible to recover. So a fair few photos there. So we can select that folder there. We have some videos. We have a couple of videos here, which might be okay to restore. So let's select the MP4s as well. There's also some audio, which may or may not be corrupted. We'll have to see. Some documents as well. That might or might not work. But there, once you've selected all the files or folders that you want to recover, you come down and click recover. Choose an area. Don't recover directly onto your the device that you've scanned. Just choose a different area. So I'm gonna create a folder on the desktop called recover. And click recover. And that will start recovering the files to the folder I've just created. Okay, so these are the files, folders that are recovered and it automatically opens up the folder that I created earlier. So if we can drill into the photos, wow, a lot of photos here. Now this, <laughs> these photos here are for when I was doing a time lapse. Um, so it's recovered all of them. But at the very start, there's an old photo there. Yeah. Wow, yeah. Let's scroll all the way down. So it's recorded all my time lapse photo photos. Wow. Okay, that's cool. I'm not sure what videos these are. Oh well, yeah, it's recovered my video. That's cool. And another video. Yeah, 
Yep. Yeah. That is good. I'm not sure what the document was. Oh, I don't know what that is. Uh, audio. And audio. No idea what that is. Okay, guys, so yes, proof there that the recovery does work. So yeah, like I said before, depending on how old the data is and how many times the device has been formatted, it might not be recoverable. Uh, but as you've seen here, it's recovered um, a lot of pictures and some videos there as well successfully. Uh, this is the Wondershare Recover It. Links are in the description below if you want to take a look. There is a, a free version and obviously the paid version as well on their website. You can use this on Mac, OS, Windows and recover pretty much any file you can think of. So thank you very much for watching. This software is a lifesaver and I'll see you very soon. Bye bye.